The boys' basketball team was in action Tuesday night as they hosted the Manchester Panthers. Let's take a look at the highlights. Early on, it was the Brenton Frank show as a Trojan senior was on fire. Here he drives through the basket and gets the bucket in the foul for a three-point play. Still in the first quarter, Franks pulls up on the foul line and buries the jumper to make it 9-7 to Trojans. Later, Franks takes it all the way to the basket and finishes to push the Trojans lead to 17-7. Franks still wasn't done. This time he connects from long range and the Tusky Valley lead is 12. More Franks as he goes inside this time and uses the glass for two more. Franks will score 16 of his 21 in the first half. Franks is on fire, but he wasn't the only Trojan who was hot that night. Here Dylan Vaughn finds Nate Lewis and Lewis finds nothing but the bottom of the net. Next trip down the floor, and once again, it's Lewis from downtown. Lewis had finished with nine points on the night. Later, Lewis with the ball once again, but this time he finds Landon Thompson, and Thompson drains yet another three-pointer. The onslaught continues as Jared Kinzel is left open, and he connects from long range. Late in the second quarter now, and Matt Salvo finds Franks, who beats the buzzer, and it's 34-17 to Tusky Valley at the break. Second half action, and the children stay hot as Kinzel connects for another three-pointer to make it 39-23. Moments later, and it's Nate Lewis again from three. The Trojans were eight for 15 from three on the night. Early fourth quarter, and Lewis finds Thompson, who buries yet another three, and the Trojans lead 46 for 30. The Trojans then use some nice ball movement, and Kinzel finds Matt Salvo. Landon Thompson then connects for two, and the Trojans seem to be in complete control, but the Panthers rally late. The lead is down to seven before Jeremy Salvo drives for two of his nine points on the night. Under a minute to go and the lead is down to four when Landon Thompson makes the defensive play of the game as he knocks the ball off of Jojo France and the Trojans hold on for the 63-57 victory.